Hello everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Caitlin if you're new here and if you're not, welcome back. Thank you so much for being here today. In this video, I'm going to guide you through just a couple of simple stretches to release tension that you may carry through your neck, through traps, and possibly in shoulders and upper back. So if you'd like to join me for these few stretches, then just keep watching. Initially, I will ask that you find a comfortable seat, one in which your spine is vertical, you have shoulders stacked just over top of your hips. If you're comfortable on the floor, that's a-okay. Otherwise, you can sit in a chair. You just want to make sure that your spine, again, is vertical and you're not slouched or rounding through your back body. Bring a lift upward through your head. And just start to gather the mind, gather the attention with a few breaths. So place either hand on your abdomen, whether upper or lower, that's up to you. But take a deep breath in. An open mouth exhale, just let your shoulders soften. Let's do one more like that. Breathe in, belly to your palm. An open mouth exhale to soften. And you use your breath to remind you where you are and what you're doing. You're here to release a little bit of stress and tension that is carried in the physical body. To so really mellow, you start twisting to the left. Send your gaze over to your left. Think chin above shoulder. And just take a breath in to the right side of your neck. On your exhale, release, and then twist to the opposite direction. Nice and slow, look to the right side of your space. And it's up to you, you can steady your gaze or close your eyes. Through the left side of your neck and throat, breathe in, sit tall. And your exhale, unwind and face forward. And then keeping with that mellow quality, drop your left ear over towards your left shoulder. Let's work with breath pace. Inhale, lift up, sit nice and tall. Exhale, drop right ear over to right shoulder. One more each side, breathe it in. Exhale, left ear to left shoulder. Last time, breathe in, sit nice and tall, shoulders back. And breathe out right ear over to right shoulder. Fantastic, inhale, lift the crown of your head. With your exhale, let your shoulders just soften down. Lovely, so let's work with the breath and movement. Inhale, lift your shoulders up to your ears. And on your exhale, roll your shoulders back and down. So nice big rotation, let's do two more like that. Inhale, shoulders lift up towards ears. And exhale to roll your shoulders back and down. Nice job, one more, breathe it in. And complete your breath out. And when you work with your breath, you want to make sure that it's low into your belly, into your diaphragm, as opposed to high up into the chest and shoulders, especially when we're trying to release and dissolve tension. Let's reverse the rotation. Inhale, shoulders draw backward, then upward. And with your exhale, roll them forward, then downward. Fantastic, two more like that, breathe it in. And breathe it out, complete that circle. One more time, inhale, shoulders draw backward, then lift upward, and exhale, draw shoulders forward, then downward. And what I'll ask that you find is, say the middle between those two, so not too much of a pull back or roll forward, you find a more neutral sensation between those two felt experiences. And just move your jaw right and left, you can even take your fingers, work into the jaw and just release some tension. Often when the jaw is clenched, that can affect the neck and the throat all the way down through shoulder girdle. So just using some mild pressure, nothing super intense. You may find some sticky spots or areas of resistance. These things are normal. And you can even work up into your temples if that feels helpful. And with that self-massage, take one more inhalation down to your belly. On your exhalation, release your hands. If you need to switch the position of your legs, now is a great time to do that as we work into the next set of stretches. Drop your right ear over towards your right shoulder, and then you'll lift your right hand up, and this may sound kind of weird, but you hook your right middle finger into your left ear. 
and it serves as amazing leverage to release tension all the way through neck, throat, trap, even top of shoulder and collarbone. Take your left forearm, wrap it around your back ribs, and that way you have a little more control to roll left shoulder back. For as long or as little as you'd like, breathe deep. Close your eyes or steady your gaze. And take one more inhalation, pull through middle finger. On your exhalation, release your left arm. Now take your right fingers to the right side of your head, lift your head back up, and then release your right hand. Just close your eyes, pause to feel the echo of that, navigate the left side of your body. As you approach second side, there's no expectation. So take a breath in, prepare with length. On your exhale, drop your left ear over to your left shoulder. You find that sweet spot or a little bit of tenderness, potential discomfort. Float your left hand up. You can bring left hand to the temple side of skull or hook middle finger into the ear for a little more control and a deeper stretch. Take your right forearm, wrap around your back ribs and use that to then roll your right shoulder back, pull your right elbow back. Feels fantastic through your trap, your collarbone, and even through pec, deep into the chest. Check in with the lower palate of your jaw. We love to hold tension there. And just stay with me for the inhalation. Exhale, unthread your right arm and take your left fingers to the left side of your head. Slowly lift up. For our last stretch today, you'll interlace your fingers as is, but behind your back. You want to bring the base of your hands as close as you can together, but please do not force or cause pain in your body. Start to straighten your arms and wrap your shoulders back. Nice big lift on the chest, and only as much as feels good, start to lift your gaze. You might consider lifting your pinky fingers a little bit higher. Big stretch for the shoulders. And just make sure that you're not holding your breath, still breathing deeply. I'll count you down for three, two, and one. Lower your hands, release that bind, and bring hands back to the legs. Try to move intuitively, chin to chest, and take half circles to the right and to the left. No full rotations, just right and left to massage the back of your neck. And then lift the crown of your head. Again, really mild, no dumping, no crunching. Drop your head back, tip your nose upward, half circles, open through the front of the neck and throat. Three, two, and one, sit nice and tall. Place your hand again on your abdomen. Breathe in deeply. And breathe out completely. And that will conclude our guided stretch session for the neck, the shoulders, upper back, and chest. I do hope that you feel a little more spacious in your upper body, a little less tense, and possibly a little less stressed. My name is Caitlin, and I do hope that you enjoyed and found benefit from these few sensations. And know that incorporating these stretches daily, even while sitting at your desk or watching TV, it's incredibly helpful for your connective tissue calming your nervous system, even just a couple of deep belly breathings. If you enjoyed this video, please be sure to give it a like and subscribe to my channel. That way you never miss a new video. As always, be kind to yourself, be kind to others, and I will see you in my next video. Bye.